West Bromwich Albion won, Blackburn Rovers won. And here's a strange thing. After just 15 matches of the season and with a club legend at their helm, some Albion fans are already discussing who should replace Darren Moore as head coach. Now, to an outsider, that might sound absolutely ridiculous. Albion are the top scorers in the country and remain, despite a run of three games without a win, in the top six of an insanely competitive division. So why the uncertainty? Well, it's quite simple, really. Big Dave insists on playing with a three-man defence and playing out from the back at almost every opportunity, despite all the evidence to the contrary suggesting that he doesn't have the players to achieve success with that. Certainly Blackburn Rovers had Albion sussed, especially after the break, pushing high up the field, winning possession through interceptions and misplaced passes, and finally getting their reward on 71 minutes when Reed struck a belter which almost burst the net to bring the scores level. In Darren's favour, the players clearly want to play for him. In the first half especially, there was a strong response to Wednesday night's drubbing by Derby. And even Craig Dawson, too poor, too often this season, was much closer to his previous best, tigerish in the tackle and popping up at the back stick from a corner to nod Albion ahead before the interval. The sense of frustration that they surrendered that lead, though, was only compounded after Blackburn had their goalkeeper, David Rayer, stretched off. They were forced to put midfielder Richie Smallwood between the sticks and were down to 10 men after using all three subs. Despite that, Albion couldn't make the breakthrough and the grumbles of discontent drew just that bit louder.